so we're back in Lake Havasu after night on BLM land. 37 uh, degrees this morning when we woke up. Yeah, but it was roasty toasty in the van. We uh, were at the world famous London Bridge. There's a visitor center here. We're gonna go see what that's all about. It's my understanding this bridge was actually in London, built in the 1800s sometime, dismantled, shipped over here, and reassembled in the 1960s. But we're gonna go to the visitor center and check that out, and then we're gonna walk across. This is just pretty impressive that somebody bought this. Had it taken down, labeled, shipped, all the way from London. A lot of granite. That's ambitious. Is it Sarah Park? Sarah Park, yeah. Sarah Park, still in Lake Havasu. We found an awesome dog park, and Dave's gonna go bike some trails over here while Pistol and I scope out this dog park. Sniff everywhere. Pistol, you have a good time, all right? <laughs> good. Good. good girl. got up, came out to this beautiful sunrise. I'm sure the camera does not do it justice, but it's phenomenal. So we're gonna pop on into Quartzsite today. Check that out. We're at the High Jolly Cemetery and monument so apparently, there's apparently the cemetery is the most visited place in all of Quartzsite so if that's an example or gives you an idea of what a happening place this is this is the highlight of Quartzsite <laughs> so this pyramid over here is the resting place of High Jolly a Greek born in Syria known as Haji Ali. Yeah, I, I read where the, the soldiers preferred High Jolly over Haji Ali. They didn't Ali. know how to pronounce it, so that they worked, went with High Jolly. That wouldn't work today, would it? That would not work today. So he was hired in 1857 as a camel herder in the U.S. Army's short-lived historic Camel Corps by Lieutenant Edward Beale in his expedition to chart a wagon road across New Mexico and Arizona. And in 61, the Civil War commenced, ending the day of the Camel Corps. Legend has it there are still camels roaming the desert out there somewhere. So, there you have it. That sums up Quartzite. So, we just left Quartzite. Um, not a lot to do there. There's tons of flea markets, swap meets, and... If you're short on rocks, you can buy lots of rocks there. If you're in the big gym and mineral shows, there are not until January. The area around Quartzsite, I mean, all the, the endless
this boondock and for miles it's just RVs just parked out in the, in the desert and if you're in the mountains 